Figure you talked about execution before, three weeks in, three weeks in. Mm -hmm. How disappointed, how surprised are you that it's as big of an issue? Um, disappointed more than anything, you know, because when you play a team like that, um, it's all the little things. It, it comes down to, <clears throat> you know, uh, that's why it was fourth and goal right there at the end. Uh, it's all the little, de little details that build up to the end, and if you don't take care of them, it'll come back to, to haunt you. Yeah, I think it's, you know, it's starting. It's hard to say after you lose, but um, I think it's starting to come together, you know. Um, we did flow better. It kind of felt like it was flowing better during the course of the game. But, uh, again, this is about execution, uh, calling the right plays, executing the plays. And, um, you know, we just didn't do a good enough job. I didn't as a coach uh, do a good enough job putting these guys in good situations. Um, like I said, execution. I think you know we we got to be more consistent with everybody doing their their job. Um, it, it seems right now we we have one guy out of place, or I'm not doing my job, or it's just it's one thing every play. Um, so we got to eliminate that first and foremost. Obviously, not the, the start you guys wanted to have this year. A lot of season left to go. What's going to be the key for you guys to, to bounce back after starting? Um, don't hit the panic button. Um, I think we realize how close we are, but that's the frustrating part is we can't have continued mistakes, you know, the same thing over and over again. We have to do our job and have to hit the reset button, look at the film, learn from it. I think we improved in a lot of areas, you know, but when you play a team like that, <clears throat> the little mistakes will get you. So we have to eliminate that. And next week we have another good opponent that's playing well right now.